Hello and welcome to this video. My name is Murray Beckham. I've had the most annoying problem recently using a Wacom graphics tablet and Windows 10. There seems to be a conflict between the Wacom graphics tablet software and also Windows Inc. Now you would think that it will be a simple process of maybe just turning off Windows Inc in Windows 10 but you don't have an easy way to do that in some versions of Windows, particularly Windows 10 Home. In the later versions of some of the Wacom pads, there's actually a tiny box within the software preferences which enable you to turn off Windows Inc. The frustrating problem that I had recently after upgrading to Windows 10 was that everything worked perfectly apart from my graphics tablet. I needed to turn off Windows Inc but I didn't have an easy way to do that. My Wacom tablet is quite old and it doesn't have an option within the preferences to turn off the Windows Inc as some of the later Wacom graphics tablets do. But I have found a solution online which I think is well worth sharing because it's worked perfectly for me. Now as you can see I've just opened up Photoshop's Adobe Camera Raw. One of the problems amongst many others was that with Windows Inc conflicting with the Wacom graphics tablet if you needed to get access to the options in the targeted adjustment or the options in the crop tool they just refuse to drop down and there's quite a number of options within them that we need. The solution is to open up Windows Explorer. I'm going to go up to the access bar at the top there and highlight it. I'm going to type into here a percentage sign, then the word app data, and the percentage sign again. When I hit the enter key, it takes us into the roaming section of our computer. Once we're in there, we need to open up the Adobe folder and we need to go to the Photoshop version we're using. I'm using CC 2019. Then I need to open up my 2019 settings. What we're going to do in here is to create a text document using Notepad. Now you can see I have opened up Notepad. If you can't find it in Windows 10, go back down to the bottom left and just type in Notepad here and you'll find quick and easy access to it. You can see what I've typed in here use system stylus space zero that's going to turn off Windows Inc. I'm going to save this calling it PS user config and I'm going to drop it into the folder that we just opened the Adobe Photoshop CC 2019 settings. That is going to turn off Windows Inc and make all of our options work correctly. Now I've just done that, saved it into that Adobe Photoshop CC 2019 settings folder which we found in the roaming section via Adobe and whatever version you're using. Now I can close this down and I can relaunch Photoshop. Opening up an image into Adobe Camera Raw, now if I go up to my crop tool and click and hold there's the options that were shut off to me just a few moments ago. And in the targeted adjustment, I've got those two. Windows Inc. is now turned off whenever I launch Photoshop and all of my problems have been solved. Now remember, if you're suffering problems with the conflict between the Wacom graphics tablet and Windows Inc., if you've got a later version of the Wacom graphics tablet, if you go into control panel and look at the preferences you may find there's a little box there that you can tick to turn off Windows Inc. If you're using an older graphics tablet which won't allow you to do that then what we've just demonstrated should fix your problem. If you're viewing on YouTube don't forget to subscribe to my channel maybe hit the notification bell as well so you're notified whenever I put up a new video.